Welcome to Gold Zone. Our special guest today is uh, senior guard Natalie White for the Spartan basketball team. Uh, recently, you went over uh, 1,100 points. Mm -hmm. You are now the 10th leading scorer in the history of Spartan basketball. Congratulations. Tell us about that milestone. Well, I'm telling you, I really had no clue coming into this year. And uh, it just comes down to you just work hard every day and you go out and play, have fun and play the game you love. And when you reach milestones like that, of course, it's a great accomplishment. And I encourage other people to you know, strive for the same thing, even though I had no clue that it was uh, approaching. But yes, when I found out, I was ecstatic, and I'm very, I'm very proud to be a part of that. You should be, because I think people that follow this team know that you, you kind of have a, a target on your back, knowing that you're the best <laughs> offensive player on this team, and you, and you see, you get a lot of attention from opposing defenses. Talk about how hard it has been to, to, to score this year, knowing that uh, a lot of opponents have been focusing on stopping Natalie White. Well, you, you surround yourself with, oh, with talent, people that can play, and uh, you got, I got great teammates that try to get me. Over Open. And if I don't have the shot, I rely on them to make it. And so um, we haven't been winning games, but we are making improvements. And um, I'm glad that I can contribute in that in that part. But yes, it's very difficult. Night in and night out, you've got about everyone focusing on you, and um, that's okay because other people have stepped up, like I said, and uh, they're kind of backing off a little bit, which is nice. <laughs> you seem to have a great attitude, and, and as a senior on a team that's not winning a whole lot, is it important for you to? Kind of keep everyone's chin up, knowing that that you know, because basketball. The neat thing about basketball is, you know, everyone's alive and, until oh, the very end. Oh is my that gosh! Important? I mean, definitely, you got to keep your head up. Um, I've always been a very optimistic person, and um, despite all the losing, there's still some good that can come out of this. And they're starting a new program here, the coaching staff yeah. um, for our team, and they have a great mindset as far as winning. And so, if I can just kind of ignite it a little bit, and maybe next year we'll get some more wins. But this year's not over. Don't get me wrong. I'm yeah. just saying that. You start things in the right path. And again, while this year's not over, it's some things that uh, we were talking about the football team a few years ago. There were some seniors on that three and eight football team mm -hmm. that the coach credited for the next few years. So, do you feel that you're kind of in the first step of uh, what, what could be something? Special? Oh, of course, yes. I'd like to think of myself as kind of the building, the structure, you know, the st setting the stone groundwork. And then they can build from there, and I hope that I can be able to contribute in that in that aspect. So yes. Yeah. All right, this yeah. weekend. Yeah. I'm ready. I'm ready. I mean, about La Tech. I'm. I'm. Um, it's La Tech. <laughs> Anybody's beatable. We can do it. Uh, I know this team's ready. I'm ready. So I would hope that my team is jumping on board right with me. So we're ready. We're always ready. Do, do your teammates have as much energy as you do? I don't know. They say that, like, they wonder all the time where I get it from. And I'm like, I don't take energy drinks. I don't. It's just me. It's who I am. So they try to feed off of that, and I try to give it to, to some of my teammates. So I'm just like that. It's it, me. It should be contagious. Good luck. To see yes, you. thank you very much.